Bit of a late start today. I just pulled up to La Puente Skate Park meeting up with Dan. I'm out here in Los Angeles County skateboarding. I haven't been up these ways in a minute and it feels nice to be up here honestly like the vibe for skating and everything is much nicer in LA County. I don't know if I'm uh, location biased or not but everybody knows skateboarding out in LA is a vibe so yeah it's quite hot today I've got some sunscreen and yeah I haven't been to La Puente in a minute so I'm keen to get some clips and have a little rad afternoon sesh. 1080? 1080, 60 frames. Yeah, Nessa, uh, Nessa's on that program too. Yeah. Oh. Low effort, he no says. Effort. If you try to balance too much on 50-50s, you throw yourself off. So what do you do? You just relax? I mean, I try to keep my arms back a little bit. And the second I need them, I use them. But if you use them before you need them, just spring yourself up. Jump in the gun. Jump in the gun. You know, you won't do first try? I'm not going to do it. You know, let me get in there and do a cricket grind. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. Cricket grind for I'd do that. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. It's been a minute. Your warm up is me doing a 50 50. Ooh. Slappy crooks are cool, but crook to slappy is really cool. Uh, what happened then? My weight was wrong. He just landed back on the wall. Ah, I got scared. 5-0 to 50? I pushy footed it because a lot of thoughts in my mind going on before I popped into the 5-0. Because when I 5-0, John Hill did a video about this recently. I'm not like this, I'm like this. Yeah. So it's a little bit sturdier to pop out, but if you want to grind the long 5-0, you have to manual it. Yep, and you kind of do a toe side one wheel manual to hold it. Watch oh, June gross. Sato, or however you say his last name, the best manual 5 er in the world. Because these tracks are as tight as a nun's. Morals. <laughs> You were just scared on that one. Yeah, you could tell, huh? You're crooking the shit out of this ledge, though. I'm misjudging my aim on the 5-0, because when you're in that position, your weight's off and out of the way from the ledge anyway. And I feel like I'm just trying to get my body comfy. I could also see you being a little spooked because it's a low ledge with a bump to it, which is, like, really hard to under. Yeah, bump, bump to stuff. Is... Especially when it's low. I had to keep my weight consciously away from the ledge and back. That's how I made it through. Okay. Oh, Thank you, sir. K felt nice. Cro crook was really I good. I wish I could crook into the bank. I'd Go out, crook into the bank? I though. could get out. I get out like. Hold it. Where do I get out at? Like maybe a foot or two? Run right into the end of it. Like grind all the way to the end. Uh, grind till you stop. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Popping out out of habit. You just gotta hold on, baby. That looks like it hurt. <laughs> rage bait this video, dude. When you said to rage bait my video, that just sounded like aggressive masturbation. I guess it could be. But like people will like post things on Reddit to get like an angry response out of people. Yeah. Like, this is straight rage bait. You still somehow almost made that work. Yeah, Sean. Whether you made it in the bank or not, that you that was definitely your longest cricket grind yet. Sometimes you gotta get what you get, take what you get. I mean, got what you did. What are you thinking?
it that easy. Front tail was slop, but it is what it is. I'm still getting used to bringing my foot back. So I'm not on the ball of my foot because, uh, yeah, that's how you get hurt. Oh, you just started that today. Yeah. He would, he would tail slide with his foot fully on. And he was asking me where I put my foot. And I was like, oh, I kind of try to get to the tip. And uh, it looks like you figured it out like right away though. It looks like you've had to figure it out in like two tries. Because this is my new thing here. Yeah, that's the spot. Because here, you leave yourself, your ankles don't articulate because your weight's all oh, oh. Being back like that gives you that buffer. Yeah, you want you want to be leaning over the, the heel side of your tail, yeah. not over the toe and, hey, side. If you drag your heel, it's okay. Because it, it's apparently it's fine. Yeah, you'll only do that. Same with no slides, you drag your heels. So. Yeah. I don't make the rules, guys. Well, that's fine. I mean, he's never done it before. Keep it manual. Keep it manual in my life. Should I just start with trying to manual it first? Um, if you want, I say you just start going for the kick with manual though. It's like slightly slanted. It kind of favors you for manual tricks. You just gotta like kick flip and then do the manual and then land it. That was harder than the trick. Yeah, you win. Big old dirty crack right in the middle of the bank here. You hate big old dirty cracks? That's yeah, crazy. You have to pick which side you're on. And one side's Republican and one side's Democrat. Yeah. You have to choose. Independent. <laughs> He's right 50 50 up the middle. This is the ace trucks. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh yeah, you have that. Oh yeah, you got this. I'm excited. Your weight is back seat here, and you have to be mindful of like still being forward but back seat. If that makes sense, because I don't want to go. That won't happen. You won't be. Uh, what is it called? The what is it called when Jesus takes everyone back? What? <laughs> Second coming? No, 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 no. Uh, not tribulation. What am I thinking of? When everyone gets sucked up into the sky, because this would look like you were doing. You look like you're oh, sucked up in the sky. Get sucked up. Judgment day. But what's it called? The rapture. The rapture. Worst part about this thing is you have to go all the way down there, okay, turn all the way on that over forty five, come back, and then still push. That was so good. You know what's fucked? I tried this for about half an hour on a curb, like just a regular ass curb at a high school. Couldn't get it. But I feel like with the pop out of the bank, it allows you a bit more play time yeah. to get your feet sorted out. If you're in the air longer, you can float. Yeah. That, that looks really good. good. Yeah, that's sick. Uh, Sean's gonna get a little taste on my board now. He has this football shape, which, what's the wheelbase on this bad boy? It's, it's something. It's, I think, it, I wanna say it's 15. Jesus, okay. And it, it's, a, it's a true twin, so. Yeah. No matter which way, I mean, obviously, you didn't set up these trucks with a twin board, did you? No, no, I didn't. So there is a front truck and a back truck. Yeah. And the line always indicates yeah. the back for me. Directional. It's yeah. a directional twin, guys. Anyway, it's a flight, so it's like one of those high technology PAL boards. <laughs> Nailed it. And he has this pepper grip, which is like the extra grip, XG or whatever. Yeah, so it's not just regular pepper, it's pepper XG. Yeah, but earlier today I was talking about how I sprained my wrist, like last week, because my back foot come off my tail, and I think it was because my grip was shitty, or it's dirty. So we're going to try out this stuff. But you can see the how much it's sparkling. A lot of, uh, a lot of sand in there to make it so grippy. Going right into skating. Ooh. I felt like the grip, I could feel it then. Already? Yeah. That was a good Smith. I wasn't expecting you to immediately start trying tricks. That was like in and out Smith. Before you even get used to it, just do a kickflip. Oh. I don't know if that's me compensating for the concave or the grip being grippy. That was a good kickflip. It didn't feel like... It doesn't feel crazy, right? Like, I would say it feels slightly grippier than normal grip. Not by much. Spongy, almost. Underfoot, it feels like. Okay. But when you go to Oli and do stuff, it's not crazy. It just feels like there's that extra... A little bit extra, but it's not a lot extra. No. Those bearings are screwing you up, I can tell. Well, the shape of the board, my heel was just like extra. Sure oh yeah, there's not a lot of uh, width to the nose.
Yeah, the bearing's not the best. It's not bad. Let's go to the front bar. <laughs> Little tail tap. It almost feels like a what? Like I'm cheating with the deck rails. Because you are cheating with the deck rails. What do you mean? It's exactly what you're doing. Let's see if I can do a backside flip out of this bank on this atrocity of a board. No offense, pal. No offense, Andy. <laughs> what about me? No offense, Andy. What about me? <laughs> We didn't compensate very well. The board didn't even come anywhere near a backside clip. It, it wasn't landing, like you didn't land as cool as what you would think. I wasn't, I, that was way cooler than I expected it to be. You rode away pretty well. Like, you have to like land and like get that lane back going. Definitely got a fat Joe. This grass also isn't like the kind that rolls easily. It's kind of stiff grass, so it like yeah. kind of pushes against the wheels. Do it again, that was cool. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. We had some Thai food, and then now we're, we spotted this spot that. Can we talk about the Thai food for a second? So, no. Oh, this is a good curve. Dude, look at this curve. Okay, back to the lady who loves me. No, she doesn't love me. So she was. She's very. Um, very friendly. Very friendly. Yes. And she just remembers us whenever we come in. Yes. And she's super rad. And then she just like randomly dropped this bombshell on us. She just randomly hit us with the I got a YouTube channel. She got channel. a YouTube channel. And I was like, wait, really? And then so she showed us it or whatever. We followed her. Yeah, we followed her. She followed us back. Yeah. Uh, and we ended up having a YouTube conversation with our Thai food lady. Yeah. What a, is it like a, that's where the universe meets. Thai food and YouTube. <laughs> it might be where it meets. This rail looks tall. A lot of uh, vacant places in uh, LA County. It's, it's kind of depressing. Like, I mean, this is just LA County. It, this is it, the world. it feels very Midwesty. You know, in the Midwest, they just have vacant shops and yeah. places, and it's like a weird vibe. That's what I feel like it's like here, but there's a rail here. Oh, it is tall. From the road, it looked didn't look it's as because bad. Because you had the illusion of this curve blocking it. Yeah. It lower. Um, it's not insanely tall, though. This yeah, is I, like a BMX spot, I think. I mean, I was scared to get it. You reckon? Yeah. I Who has that pop? I could, I could skate here. Into a board slide, but it, people can skate this. I'm definitely out here, yeah. What do you mean? And there's some gum trees too. Look. Is that what those are called? Gum yep. trees. Yep. That's where koalas live in Oz. Should we walk behind this building? We should. From back there, does this look like it was a ramp? And as you get closer, it's just a wall. Did you know it was a wall or did you oh, think yeah, it was a ramp? I was saying board slide pop out tricks. Oh, I thought it was like a, a, a loading dock. Oh, no, no, no. I was looking, I thought it was weird as the way that this yeah. handrail is built into the wall. It just that one section. Disappears into the wall. It's a matrix. You can bang off the loading dock with the up to landing right there. This is some Ohio type shit, dude. I would definitely see if this is good. Like, would you? Yeah, I would see if I could, how far I could land. So I'd probably like ollie here and I'd probably like land there. Yeah. But I think I cleared it. Oh, look, there's actually, is that angle? Oh, That'd be cool if you're a kid. There you go. Nada. Nothing. Good skate off that roof. You know, it's not super often in California where you like travel and try to find spots and you don't find spots. Yeah. Like, this experience right here was so par for the course on the east I, coast. I, really? Oh yeah, you just travel. I would do hours. I literally because I didn't have a car. I was you know, uh -huh. like 15. I would skate, skate around for around. hours and find zero spots. Oh, it was great. What a humbling experience this has been. Red, I want you to go to his house. Blow that joint up, don't let nobody out. Oh, get Trigger Man, bring him to me, cause I'm tired of this Trigger Man stuff in Tennessee. Now all the time while this stuff is going on, I called up another roadie on my flip phone. Junior, I want you to call down the Texas Special Order Leader 1994.